All right, well, we're going to go over a throw tonight. Um, this is a variation of Ipon Silnagi. You know, everybody is used to doing the Ipon Silnagi throw underneath here, okay? But a lot of guys, I see a lot of guys in competition. I recently had a guy do this to me in competition. He did a cross grip. You know, maybe like he was going to try to go for some kind of standing choke or something, but he didn't really do anything with it. Um, so I took him down. So uh, it's okay to it's okay to grab a cross, but my advice is is that you don't just get the grip and uh, and just sit here. You got to do so. You got to attack as soon as you get uh, both hands on one side of the gi. You need to be attacking. In judo, if you grab, you've only got about two or three seconds before they give you a penalty for grabbing this way and not doing anything with it. So we're here and here. We're gonna reach across. We're gonna grab in, inside his car. Maybe he's thinking, oh, he's trying to do some kind of crazy uh, standing choke on me. Make sure you guys keep your elbow down. That makes it a little harder for him to do a flying armbar on me because be aware you are susceptible to a flying armbar when you grow a cross grip like this. So be careful um, when, when you do that, it happens. It's happened to me before. So here, as soon as I get this cross grip, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start circling this way with the guy. I'm circling this way and see what this has the tendency to do. As he's, it pulls, he wants to come, this side of his body comes forward. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to step in, my foot steps in. As I, come, as I get him coming around, I'm going to step in, and I'm going to do my double knee drop underneath him. And, and throw him that way. So, again, so, we're your traditional judo grip, grabbing his, his lapel and the sleeve. Make sure it's mainly the bottom three fingers doing most of the gripping, both on the sleeve, just kind of getting this grip and flicking my wrist out, getting my, my hand in this position, getting the grip on the lapel, and straightening my wrist. That's how I like to grab it. Initially, so we're here, we're fighting. I'm going to switch. As soon as I switch, I'm going to start circling. I'm going to step in and throw him over me. This grip gives me a lot of tight control over the shoulder. So I don't have to do that whole telegraph come under the arm thing. That can be, you know, the guy sees that coming a lot longer away than this. He doesn't expect it. So here, circle, step. You want to be almost, under, try, to, try to step almost underneath the guy. You want to shoot pick the shoulder up like that? Yeah, you want to pick the shoulder up if you're going to go for an arm bar. Okay. Thank you. 